focus whoever blasphemes against the holy spirit never has forgiveness but is guilty of an eternal sin if christ has appeared once for all at the end of the ages to put away sin by the sacrifice of himself how come he himself says that there is a sin that can never be forgiven christ did not mind if they were insulting him that is the son of man as he made clear elsewhere a sin against the son of man would be forgiven because it could be out of ignorance or misunderstanding but a sin against the holy spirit is an intentional act of malice whereby one attributes evil to one who is goodness personified likewise attributing a good deed to the devil is deliberately denying the power of the holy spirit it is this cold blooded assertion which shows no sign of repentance that makes it the unforgivable sin repentance is the key here no repentance no forgiveness one who does not acknowledge one sin does not seek to have it forgiven so those who blaspheme against the holy spirit are actually condemning themselves and rejecting god's love even considering whether one has sinned against the holy spirit indicates that one has awareness of offending god's goodness and is ready to repent fruit may you always be aware of god's power and love and mercy and never be so removed from god that i would deliberately reject him